totally worth it. Hey, what's up guys? Trex here, and welcome back to another episode of Trivia 1.3 with TXW. We are back in the 1.3 Let's Play world. In this episode, what we're going to be doing is finally we are going to explore the underground jungle. Or, not the underground jungle, the underground desert, I mean. It's just been sitting here for too long. We haven't done anything about it. But first, I've gotten several requests to craft a fart in a jar with the cloud in a bottle and the whoopee cushion, so I guess we'll just do that. Uh, material, I don't see any special perks. What, what, what does it does? What's it? A precise fart in a jar, so we get plus two critical strike chance. But, no, come on, open the door. Let's see what it does. Yes, I can see how that would be very entertaining. Totally worth it. Anyways, on to our adventure. Man, I'm really glad you guys suggested this. Yep. Oh, it kind of gives me a little... Oh, it's kind of giving me a little boost as well. Oh, I know, that's just from the... Um, that's just the boost from the... Uh, cloud in a bottle. But anyways, here we are. It's gonna be super distracting. <laughs> um, anyways, here we are at the dig site, lowering ourselves into King and Tutankhamun's Commons tomb. Get it, King? Wait, dang, King and Common, King Toot and Com. Get, get it, get it, get. Uh. I'm trying a new microphone setup for this episode. The microphone is to my left, farther away from my computer, um, so that hopefully it eliminates that uh, annoying buzzing. Uh, it's in the background of most of my videos, and, and um, it has more of the keyboard because I just got a new keyboard. Uh, I upgraded from the Razer Black Widow Tournament Edition, which is like a 75% keyboard or whatever it is. I don't quite know the classifications. To a um, Corsair K70 RGB uh, keyboard, which is a full keyboard, and I really, really like it. It is very, very nice. I don't have it set on the gaming mode. Dang it, it's on the flashing, distracting mode that I just have for casual use. Oh boy, that's gonna be fun in perilous situations. Anyways, um, so yeah, tell me what you guys think about the audio, if it's any different, if you like the old mic setup. We'll see. I think we got some fossils up there. Let's check that out. What I'm going to do for this, oh, we already scared this. What I'm going to do for this episode is, starting in a few moments, um, I'll just cut around to the interesting parts in the episode so that it's, I'm trying to, I've noticed that my channel has sort of gone downhill, I'm trying to um, get that better, I'm trying to fix it, I'm trying to reinvigorate it, reimagine it, and so yeah, uh, after we check out this fossil we'll get around to that, let's just see what's in here real quick. Anything interesting? Just some tin. Tin and any friends that I might have. No, no friends. No girls either. Just ugly crustacean things with claws. Oh, homecoming memories. Alright, let's see if we can mine this fossil. Yes, we can! Thank goodness. I think we can make some fossil armor out of this. So I don't quite know how to make all that stuff. This is just still some very, very new 1.3 stuff. Let's, um, let's check it out, though. I should have brought some bombs. That uh, would have been very useful. Here we have a big, dark, scary pit. Do I have any glow sticks on me? Just Oh, that's, that's really not dark or scary at all. In fact, it's quite boring. Oh, well. All right, got some new bombs just to make this mining and digging stuff a bit easier. Man, I really want a new sword. This light's bane is killing me. It's killing me. But I bought 99 bombs from the demolitionist so that we can just easily mine up these greats. Gosh, I'm really starting to regret this deci decision. Um, no. Go away. Go away. Whatever that noise is, go away. We're just going to turn all these into or 50 of them at least in sticky bombs. Boom. Okay. Anything interesting in here? Nope. Nope. Okay. Moving on. Down here, anyways, there's a large, large thing of fossil. There it is. 
And there's my ex-wife. Cheryl, I already gave you the tables. What do you want now? Wait, does Bomb not do anything to the fossil? That does I just wasted a bunch of bombs. Dang, I have to mine all this out myself. I am really not finding anything interesting in these caves. I don't know what the big deal about the underground jungle is. I'm getting the fossil, but I'm not really finding anything interesting. No cabins, no chests, no new enemies. Just the remains of the pyramid that I've already discovered, like down in the corner, and some demon altars, but nothing interesting so far, except for these little hives or whatever they are I don't know what else there is I'll, just, I'll keep looking though come on Brendan Fraser I know you're in here somewhere what that was okay um got a coin portal that was the most fake sounding what I've ever said but <laughs> That really caught me by surprise. That was interesting. I didn't... I was just blowing up to see if I could find anything. I just found some caves, I guess. Oh, dang it. Run away. Oh, no. Not the bomb. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, man. I'm really losing control of these bombs. Wait a second. Is... Hold on a second. What is that sandstone brick up there doing? That went, oh, that, I guess, wait, no, you're a sticky bomb, you're supposed to stick to things. Um, I guess that's just part of the, pier that is just part of the pyramid. Okay, it must be a solid part to a certain extent, it's not completely solid all around it. Okay, I figured out the anatomy of the pyramids. Um, I thought that might have been a secret. I was wrong. Come on, discover something interesting. A cabin, or a tomb, or an ancient demon spirit. Whoa, there's alien chargers everywhere. What was that? Was that a sandworm or something? What is this, dune? I don't have any spice. Go away, worm. I've only seen the uh, terrible Bollywood movie. I haven't actually read the book yet. Please don't kill me. No, it's come and get it, worm. Oh, dang it. I thought he'd go through the bomb and explode. That was supposed to be really cool. But it just kind of wasn't. It didn't work at all. Oh well. One of my favorite things about the water bolt is that it's so useful for mapping out like caverns and places you can't see. Because it just gets in there. It's like sonar. I've said this many times. I use it like sonar. It's awesome. And it also like clears out the enemies and everything. It's so great. That's one of the main reasons I keep it. Oh my gosh, this is a massive fossil. Oh, oh my, I discovered a, um, a rail. Actually, that's pretty sweet. Let's just get rid of these stupid swarmer things. They can discover where this goes. Oh, I think I just saw... Yep, we have our first interesting thing. And a second railroad, actually. This is... Okay, what's in here? Ah... We got ourselves a clown bottle, some rope, and some silver. Not bad for the first chest. I think I saw one back there, though. Uh, another cabin, that is. Let's actually just torch this area up like a rainforest. Yep, here we go. Another cabin. Let's check what's inside. Shoe spikes, recall potion, nothing interesting. I'm really looking out for a magic mirror because that would be super useful. And then I can name it Mike, and it'd be my magic Mike. Mirror thing. And now let's see where the rest of the line goes to. See if there's anything interesting. Up, nope. Oh, wait. Yes, there is something interesting. Um, let's check it out. Go away, you stupid dune worm. Okay, come on. What have you for me? Hermes boots. Sweet. I just realized how good that is. I thought I had those, but then I remembered I don't. Now we can combine them with the rocket boots to make. The, the other boots, the boots whose name I just forgot that I really should know because I made it multiple times. Yep, just saw that another cabin down there. Okay, ancient typer just waiting in the comments. I see it. We're going to it. Let's get there. 
Okay. Please, please, please have a magic mirror. Come on, come on, come on. Dang it. Hermes boots. And there's a doom worm thing. Oh, but well, we have another cabin. Okay, man, there are just cabins everywhere now. Okay, come on, fly away. Fly away. Fly away. Oh, man. Nope, put on a bottle. Nothing too interesting. Should find another cabin soon, though, with the luck we've been having. Let's just fire into the crowd. Oh, my gosh, they're coming at me! And that's why I'm terrified of girls. Okay, we are approaching the end of the desert part. Uh, it's starting to get more and more just caverny looking. Uh, but that doesn't mean that we're out of cabins per se. Let's see if we can't get a torch placed in there. Yeah, nothing interesting. Oh, dang it, I need to grab that chandelier. Yeah, this is just regular wooden underground cabin. Um, we have so much more to explore. We have like all this area to explore. But uh, I think that that's good for now. I'm going to try and find a magic mirror. Hopefully. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Let's just do something quick. Come on. Uh, Upsploding. With these remaining tin bombs. See if we can't find anything else interesting. Come on, just up here. I saw a name. Yep, there's something up there. I don't know what it is. But that means that there's definitely a cabin above us. There we go. Antleon Charger. Come on, stand over the bomb. Oh, almost perfect timing. Actually, perfect timing. Because he got very, very badly damaged and he fell down. Anything, anything, anything. No, 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 no. Don't see anything. We'll try up here. Just get through this little stone blockade. Fire around here. Nope, nothing. Well, we actually, I just remembered that there's a second half of the uh, mine cart system that we didn't check out. So let's head back over there. We can just get past this guy. This underground desert place is pretty cool. I wish you'd come here earlier in the series, but we need to check out what this fossil does for us. Let's, um, let's just ride this baby back. Yeah, there's definitely some stuff along here that I've missed, but, oh well, I'll just, I'll, I'll, I'll get the rest of it, eventually. I'll come up, I'll come back here off camera and report on what I find to you guys. Okay, let's slow down through here. Anything interesting? Nope. Nada. Come on, just one cabin. You know what we need? We need this bad boy, the water bolt. It won't fit in the gaps, therefore it's useless. <sighs> so, oh my gosh, they're coming for me. They are, okay, they're stuck. Good, good, good. Anything down here, just please, something. Map out the area for me, water bolt. Anything interesting at all? Nope. No cabins. Nothing. Oh. I'll have to keep exploring then. Yep, that's where that's where it's starting to end. So, we still have quite a bit to explore of this, but I'll do that on my own time. Let's get back to the vault now. Oh! Oh, wait a second! Wait a second! Look at that! We have one more cabin. Let's see if it holds. Dang it. Nothing interesting. Let's, uh, let's throw away the, um, these potions. We have enough of those. Let's throw away the tin ore. Let's just take the rest of this. Spear, statue, hiking. Throw away sticky bombs. Two, three, four, five. Reveal anything, anything at all. Nope. Nada. Yeah, okay. Oh man, we better get out of here before we get just demolished. Okay. That's enough exploring. I'll come back here sometime later and recall potion. There we go. We made off with 13 gold though, so that's, that's nice. Where'd all the rest of it go? We have exactly 53 gold coins. That's pretty good. 
Let's uh, quick stack most of this stuff up real quick. Just as much as we can, and then we'll see what this fossil does. And we'll also make ourselves the Spectre Boots. That's what they're called. Yep, just remember that. Okay, Spectre Boots. There we go. Warding, so plus four defense. That is very useful. And we get some bonus speed. So let's see what this fossil does. Where do we use it? How do we use it? Good thing I have the wiki open. I need to make a face blade. Oh, for that we need a meteor. Um, fossil. How do we... Okay, desert fossil. It can be used... Can we use the extractinator to produce sturdy fossil? Um, okay, it looks like we're going to need a lot more fossil if we need to make anything. Bone javelin, bone throwing knife, amber staff, fossil helmet, fossil plate. That's interesting. What does this do? 12 defense. That's worse than ours. But it's set bonus is 50% chance to not consume throne armor. Yeah, that would have been a lot more useful ha uh, earlier in the game. But we did get an extractinator out of that, so that's good. Let's just... Oh, nope. Come on, give it back. So it's like another form of silt, I guess, because we can get normal drops. So yeah, anyways, guys, that's it for this episode of Terraria 1.3 TX. If you leave your comments about the audio in, in the comment section below, because I need to know how that's working out. Uh, the new setup. I might try out a different mic. Um, tell me what you think of this edited format for Terraria episodes. If I do something like this, it'll probably be once a week if I do it consistently. I don't know. I'll see how it works. But anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you all next time. If you liked the video, be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome content. And goodbye!